Oh, Dunn's agreed to a scouting mission on Habitat 7. I'm gearing up now. I'm worried about Sarah. Dr. Tapera says she'll be fine, but she's my daughter. How can I not worry? I hate to leave her like this. It's these moments when you wish you told your children you love them more often. Or ever. Which brings me to the tough part. Kids, if anything happens to me, there are... Things you're gonna find out. I hope you'll understand. Ooh, secrecy. Amazing how life can change in an instant. Suddenly my career doesn't matter. This incredible woman I've been married to all these years. She's facing the end. All I think about are the times I wasn't there for her. Well, that's going to change. It occurs to me that Sam might be more than I ever imagined. That log is not currently accessible. Unlocking my memory array may enable it. That log is not currently accessible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unlocking my memory array may enable it. I am Dr. Liara Tassoni, and I've spent several decades researching ancient Protheans. It is common knowledge that the Protheans were an advanced race that flourished in the Milky Way about 50,000 years ago, then went extinct. Even at the time of this writing, the year 2182, their culture remains a that's mystery. Right, right. During my studies, I have developed some practices that can be used when analyzing any ancient culture. I hope they may prove it? useful for the research community. Oh, good. Hot cars suck, bruh. Just sucks, doesn't it? Put hair on your chest. See what Tan gave us? I hear it's something special. Pathfinder en route. How's the ship? And final checks looking great. We won't be long. The way things are going, we'll be on our own out there. In other words, we're making this up as we go. <laughs> we used to call that tactical improvisation. But at least we'll be doing it in style. Oh, the frame rate's a little slow. They call her the Tempest. Oh my god, that smile is horrendous. Ooh, it's a pretty ship. Closer look. Let's pick it up a bit, people. We're 14 months late. So you're the one who's making everything happen. Oh, my female Turian crew. Vetra. Vetra Nix. Initiative Wrangler, Provisioner, Gunner, and everything in between. Are we ready? The sooner we get out of here, the better. You're coming with us? Yes. Otherwise, there's no way they're letting this ship off the station. 
What's the rush? Just don't want to waste any more time. Hold it, hold it! You're not going anywhere. Damn it. Is something wrong? Director Addison wants to see a complete report of the Tempest supplies, munitions, and crew. Director Tan overruled Addison. The ship's loaded out with equipment for outpost discovery, squarely under Director Addison's purview. Seen you around. Ben, right? Came here with a family, didn't you? Son still in cryo? I could pull some strings, get him to the front of the line. Holy shit, she really? is... She yeah, is ballsy. Really. They told me he wasn't essential. But I miss him. I know. I got family too, Ben. It's done. <sighs> Addison's gonna kill me. Thank goodness. For a sec, I thought I was gonna have to deal with Addison again. <laughs> and no one wants that. All things considered, it was an easy ask. And right now, you need people tearing down obstacles, not putting up more. Finally, someone who cares about doing stuff and not just talking about it. I like her so far. So I got this thing off the internet called a fidget cube. It's basically a, a like a, yeah. It's this, the little, yeah, the buttons and the little Everything's ball. Everything's state of the art. The switch. Flash, sensors, exploration gear. Lesser crew, they're of course. Neat. The best in their field. Ah, glad to see you looking well. The engine core is based on the Ark's Odyssey drive. It runs a hell of a lot quieter. That's Gil Brody. Engineer, mechanic, all-around wrench jockey. Wrench jockey. We call this the research room. There's space for upgrading equipment, gathering intel. Router engaged. Securing connection to Tempest. Welcome aboard, Sam. And Ryder, of course. All run by Suvi Anwar, our science officer. Your quarters are below. Plenty of space up here to get everyone together. It's all yours. She's light, stealthy, and the fastest ship in her class. It's really gonna be something, isn't it? I haven't even shown you the best part. When you're ready to fly, head over to the bridge. Our pilot should have everything good to go. Better head to the bridge when we're ready to go. The meeting room. You can make vid calls from the central table or just get the crew together. We call this the research room. You can run research projects and coordinate with the Nexus from here. That's the bio lab. We can grow plants for food and oxygen and keep any specimen safe. Some serious kit over here. Seems like we're forever racing. But there's always time to check out new toys. Useful ones. Always game for new toys. This makes use of old ones. Like anything you grabbed on Habitat 7. Raw minerals, tech, doesn't matter. The research station will strip that stuff down and give you options. I'll take any advantage I can get, even if it's exploring junk. Hey, with tech like this, it won't be junk for long. Not after we're through. If the best we get is what we make, still the best. Check it out. <laughs> Select research and unlock new blueprints and augments using research you've acquired. Hmm. Select the old craft equipment and nomad upgrade using blueprints of research and materials you've gathered.
Hmm. There's a lot to do in this, man. Holy shit. It's <laughs> a crazy looking shotgun. Our tech lab is an engineer's dream. It's perfect for any delicate technical work. I wonder how fast that engine core clocks in. Securing cargo and checking everything made it on board. The bridge report's ready. Mm, there's our warp drive. Hi there. Can we talk and stuff later? I've got some last minute adjustments. She'll be ready to go when you are. We're almost out there. Hello. Finally. I've just got to finish this download from the Nexus. We'll be ready for launch. Finalizing orders, flight plan, command access. Ready when you are. We have cereal. Fuck yeah, we have cereal. Port's ready. Ah, oh, the midday. <laughs> 